In this session, we'll be discussing member permissions. Managing a member's permissions will allow you to delegate what management rights they have regarding modules and the ability to delete a user from the group. Reasons for changing a member's permissions may be to allow a member the ability to manage files, website, checkbooks, or any other modules turned on in your portal. Before we start, make sure you're in your organization's portal and that you have the proper permissions to manage another member's permissions. Let's navigate to members by clicking on people. In this section, you'll see all the members within the organization. To manage a member's permissions, simply click on the desired member. When clicking on the person, you'll notice that the right display has changed and now displays the member's information. To change the same member's permissions, simply select permissions. Here you'll see all the modules in this portal that the user has the ability to manage. Simply check or uncheck the box next to the module that you would like to have the person manage. For example, I'll select files for this particular user. As you can see, there are several modules that one person can manage, being that those modules have been turned on within your portal. If you ever wish to delete a member from the portal, simply navigate back to the member's profile and you'll notice a delete user from portal option just below. This option is beneficial for deleting members who have graduated or those who are no longer active members of the organization. Understanding the different user permissions will go a long way in distributing the workload of maintaining an active and up-to-date portal. 